Hey there, Internets. Pixel Geek here with a Udesley tutorial on how to convert a Webflow project into a WordPress theme using Udesley's new app and Chrome extension. All right, let's go to my screen and show you how easy it is. All right, so before I started uh, this recording, I went to webflow.com slash templates and grabbed a free blog template. Now, you can create a design from scratch, but just for demo purposes, I got a blog template. And in this template, it already comes prepared with a couple of collections, AKA databases, and some example blog posts, as you can see here, all right? And also in this template, there's some nice subtle animations, like that fade in and that slide in, and yeah. So let's pretend that I'm done and I'm like, I'm ready to convert this to a WordPress theme. So first thing I need to do is turn on the Udesley Chrome extension. So I'm gonna click on it and now I get to choose which one, which platform do I want to convert it to. So this one we're gonna choose Webflow to WordPress. Okay, so that's done. And now I'm going to go ahead and export the code from Webflow. Now, if you don't have access to this feature, it probably means you're on a free Webflow account plan. So what you'll need to do is upgrade to a light or higher account plan and you'll get this uh, feature. All right, so now I'm going to download the zip. There we go. And now we get to go to Udesley's website. And after you log in, click on go to app at the top right. Then click on getting started. And now we're going to drag in the zip file that we got from Webflow. Upload our theme configuration, which is that config file from the Chrome extension. Now for theme screenshot, I skipped this part because I didn't create one, but you can if you want. Now I'm gonna click on convert. And that's it. Now it's a WordPress template. So I'm gonna download that template go to my WordPress dashboard and install the theme by going to appearance, then going to themes, and then clicking on add new at the top left and upload theme. We're gonna choose file and find the non Webflow zip file. Click open, install, and there we go. Now we're going to activate it and notice how it's active right now, but we have one more step. Udesley has an app that you need to install. So I'm gonna click on begin installing app, install, return to required plugins installer, activate, and that's it. Now let's look at our new WordPress theme by clicking on visiting uh, visit site and if you notice the animations, the interactions, and the demo blog posts are all there. Everything that you found in Webflow is now here as a WordPress template. Now onto the hardest part of this process, trying to figure out what to do with all this free time that you've saved yourself and your client. Well, in any case, uh, go ahead and try out the new Udesley app and Chrome extension over at udesley.com.